Hey guys, what's happening? Welcome back to Hood, Outlaws and Legends. Last time we saw the Ranger, now it's time to check out the Hunter. That's all we got. Hi everyone, I'm Andrew Willens, game director hey. on Hood, Outlaws and Legends. What's up? I'm here to show off one of our playable outlaws, the Hunter. A blade in the darkness, carving a bloody path of vengeance. Vengeance. Elusive and mysterious, her quick takedowns, invisibility magic, and smoke grenades make her a silent terror in infiltration and assassination. I see. So more of a close range. Her assassin. main weapon is an arm-modified crossbow, which can load up to three bolts at once to fire a deadly burst, making it perfect for close to mid-range encounters. Right. Her special trait is shadow, which allows her to assassinate guards from any direction. This grants her unique angles of attack that the other outlaws don't have access to, ah. making her a valuable stealth asset for the team. Her gear item is smoke. It can obscure visibility, hide sight lines, and prevent tagging. Offensively, you can use it to cover your approach. Defensively, it is useful for daring escapes and to obscure the enemy's view on mission-critical objectives. I Finally, see. the hunter's ultimate ability is the shroud. It covers her More in invisible. a near invisible sheen and makes her completely undetectable by guards. Cool. You can use it to take out a group of elite knights or to get the drop on some unsuspecting players. With unlockable perks, you can customize the hunter's abilities and weapons. You can choose to modify her crossbow to fire faster shots, but at the cost of bolt durability. Stealthier perk options include ways to improve her shroud ability by chaining assassinations together to extend its duration. Mm -hmm. Thanks for tuning in to the Hunter Outlaw Overview. See you next time. Cool. Awesome, interesting. So, you know, her ultimate ability, she goes invisible, but from what I've seen, once you attack somebody, you become visible again. Unless, like they said, you can, like, uh make that duration last longer by you know chain assassinating people which could be interesting so again a more close range type of assassin right um well the ranger was more like you know stay stay far you know you got like a bow you know just like kill people take people from a distance this one with the with the hunter you really gotta go in behind them from from the front back sides from the looks of it and just take them out real close very cool, interesting, interesting. I can't wait to see what the other two classes have to offer. I'm guessing the guy with the with the hammer there, he must be like some sort of a tank or some something, right? And the other guy looks like a fighter or something, a fighter or a warrior. I'm not sure. Uh, we'll see what's up. Thank you for watching. Catch you on the next one. Peace out.